Hello folks, this is Fred from CR Machine, long time no see, it's been a while since I made a video, this one's a simple one, short one, yet it's very significant and I'm very excited to help make your motorized bicycle experience a little more reliable. So, um, this is about the cylinder head torquing, cylinder head nuts, and preventing um, the very common problems that people have with head gasket leaking, even base gaskets blowing out. And to more severe problems, like the threads of the studs stripping out of the block, even breaking the block, the, the, the crank case. So here's a solution to it. We've got it. So it's the heart of the problem is expansion rate. The expansion of the steel studs is much less than the expansion rate of the aluminum cylinder head and the aluminum cylinder. So when the engine gets hot the aluminum grows much faster rate than the steel does, and it compresses the heck out of the gasket. So here's the solution. You see this cut cutaway view of it? Well, that's an uh, enlarged version of what this is. It's called a, this is a disc spring It's a or a Belleville washer. So um, what this does is will, uh, and when properly torqued, will uh, keep a consistent torque on the head. Yeah, it's really great. I'm very excited about this. From now on, I will be uh, selling the heads uh, with these washers instead of normal flat washers. And uh, engines will be installed uh, with these as well. And, um, and I'll offer them for for you to purchase as well. You know, it'll be a little more expensive because it's only going to be four of them and you know, I have to print a shipping label and put it in a box and yada, yada, yada. You know, the, the handling costs and the shipping costs will be more expensive than the washers themselves. But it is what it is, you know. If you, you know, the, only, the only other alternative is, you know, buying a, a, a larger quantity and that'll end up costing you even more so you know I don't know but anyway enough of that uh, the only thing that you have to uh, uh, ensure and this is the purpose of the video is that the washer gets installed properly uh, you see the upside here the upside face that has to be in contact with the bottom face of the nut and here's how you do it it's very simple when the head off of your engine, well, you take the, the washer uh, and install it on like a screwdriver or something like that. Now, the cupped end should be facing down, and you drop that onto the cylinder head. So you take your, see, I'm holding the, uh, I'm holding the washer with my finger, put the screwdriver through the hole. And release. Okay, the peaked side is going down. And when you invert it, now the dished face is pointing down. And you drop that into the hole. Yeah. There. Now they are oriented correctly. Now you take your nuts, and I prefer to uh, lubricate the threads with oil or grease. You drop the, the nuts in the hole. Now your assembly is ready to fit to your engine. You put that on, and you carefully torque, you know, opposites, opposites. And what you do is you make sure you get the torque right now. That's, that's the next step. Make sure the torque is right. Now you got fine threads and coarse threads, and... Technically, uh, uh, those different thread pitches should be torqued at different specs. Um, I would say 
about uh, five foot pounds or 60 inch pounds for fine threads and about seven foot pounds uh, what's uh, seven times twelve um, that's seventy uh, eighty four eighty five inch pounds for coarse threads okay that's this is a light torque folks you just uh, you know you don't bear down on it hard no 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 you do not want to compress you don't want to fully flatten out this spring when you torque it you can experiment okay you can feel the uh, nut tighten snug up against it and then you can feel what it feels like to fully compress that spring okay what you want to do is be somewhere in the halfway mark you want to compress the disc spring um, maybe about halfway um, don't fully flatten it because then you will it'll be the same as just a simple flat washer so okay um, there it is folks and uh, this is great this is going to make uh, things a little more reliable as they should be all right enjoy thank you